Hey guys, we're going to talk a little bit about Magic's history back in the day when I used to play Magic was Legends and Beta and all that type of stuff. And one card I opened was Earthbind. Earthbind, it was a card, it's irrelevant what it does because we're going just to comment on the artwork back in the day. So in 1994, I believe Earthbind was, my first Earthbind was a revised. I had a friend uh, it was elementary school, I feel like. Yeah, I think it was elementary school, and he would collect Earthbinds. And the really weird kid, but the artwork of fantasy has changed significantly since back in those days, where this was apparently acceptable and went to print. So pretty much Magic the Gathering wasn't very big. Like if somebody printed this card today, Magic the Gathering, people would be absolutely, I mean, they might even riot. I'm sure uh, a lot of the known Magic pros would be against this card. And maybe some were not, I don't know. But back in that day, back in 1994, 1995, when I was like seven, yeah, definitely in middle school, and we're playing Magic the Gathering, this one was just what the genre was at the time. Now, is it acceptable today? In my opinion, absolutely not. Um, this is not something that you want little kids to be playing with or be, you know, have, oh, cool, I got this in my booster pack and show their parents. Uh, you could see how that would lead to this card used to be debated so heavily um, by the Magic the Gathering. Um, it has pretty much been forgotten throughout time. I feel like that's been purposefully so, but it is part of Magic's history. Magic has a very interesting history, not all of it very good, but you know, there's plenty of other um, cards that are questionable at best and pretty offensive at worst. This card, in my opinion, if it was reprinted with the same artwork, would, yeah, it would just be terrible. Um, I find this card very offensive. And, but when, think about it, if you're a little kid and you're seven or eight years old and you look at this card and you show your parents this card or you show your parents' friends this card, I don't know, if you show like an adult this card and this is a card game you are playing and, I mean, again, you're in middle school or in elementary school, what do you feel like the parents would say? Would they encourage you to continue this card game or would they say, huh, maybe this is not for you. I might want to enroll you into like a sport or something. So Magic has a very interesting history and not all of it is being recorded. Um, all the good parts are, but some of the bad stuff pretty much is being hidden and and I felt like it was uh, interesting because this particular card has a was debated for a very long time in the past. And I haven't found any videos or any uh, commentary on it um, at all online, which is so strange to me because I felt like in 1994, 1995, there was a lot of talk about this card. It just didn't translate, obviously, into uh, 2015.